you know, folks here uh, in East Tennessee, you might still see turtles crossing the road or, or, or basking in a lake. Um, and those are temperate turtles, so they are used to uh, the different seasons here, whereas our Aldabra tortoises, that's a small island about 300 miles in northwest of Madagascar, completely tropical. They just are not adapted to our cold weather, and that's why they have to go into our climate-controlled uh, uh, greenhouse that stays a balmy 80 degrees year-round. It's wonderful. One of our rangers was doing their, uh, their frequent inspections of the, of the different facilities here at the zoo to make sure everything was all right and she noted that uh, the carbon monoxide alarm was going off in our giant tortoise greenhouse and so our director of operations Shane Chester came in um, and then I got here and it was just decided that the safest thing to do would be to, to move the tortoises out. When you have to move several hundred pounds of, of tortoises you know you have to have a team to do that. Thankfully a lot of our uh, operations folks were here helping out with Lou at the zoo and then we had to find a place to put them because you know again you just can't you can't put them outside obviously it's cold um, they don't like that being from a tropical climate you're traveling through the zoo now you might go to the valley of the kings exhibit and look in the lion courtyard and you're going to see four giant tortoises and then big al is currently hanging out off exhibits uh with uh, Dolly and Polly, our, our, uh, North, our southern white rhinos. Al is a big boy. He doesn't typically see animals larger than him. Um, and the rhinos are like, well, why is this moving rock in our, in our barn? What is happening? Why are people here this late? This team is just amazing. It only took about two hours, which, you know, to move about a ton of tortoises is, is pretty impressive, uh, especially coordinating with different animal areas. And, and, and thankfully, you know, Zoonoxel is really like a family. We all help out when needed.